โอ้ไม่น่าเชื่อครับโอ้นกไปแล้วครับ Before tension, n e s i k a w a was the current Rise Featherweight World Champion at kickboxing. Before tension amassed the social media following of 180,000 followers on Instagram, as well as 158,000 on Twitter at the time of this recording. Before Floyd Mayweather came out of retirement to fight tension in Tokyo on New Year's Eve 2018, citing many people to go, "What the actual?" Oh, I had a chance to see some highlights of tension. Unbelievable fighter, great skills, great talent, a lot of power, and extremely fast. Tension Nesikawa is a Japanese kickboxer and is currently making headlines this week as Floyd Mayweather's newest opponent. While Japanese fans will be watching their boy Tension do what he does best, it has been reported, although not confirmed, that Floyd may be exploring uncharted territory. While several experts, as well as regular Joe's online, doubt it, rumor has it that Floyd may be trying out MMA. Whether it is true or not, this is going to be a fight for the ages. Literally, the two have an age difference of 21 years. But what makes the fight especially interesting is that Tension, well, he's relatively an unknown. Now, when the fight was first announced, many people from around the world were asking who Tension Nasukawa really was. I know I was asking, how the hell do you say his name? Tension Nasukawa. Several news publications referred to him in headlines as an actual mystery man. Now, if you're one of those people typing his name into Google for the first time, you'll be happy to know that Mr. Mayweather has his work cut out for him. Since the age of five, Tension has been cleaning up in martial arts. Seriously, he was practically wiping the floor with fighters around the world, and since 2014, he has dominated the kickboxing ring. With a current record of 27 to zero, well, this kid has little stopping him from becoming one of the deadliest fighters in the history of the sport. That is, if Floyd doesn't put a hurting on him in the coming fight this New Year's Eve. Now, to get into the spirit of good old prize fighting, well, we decided to do some research into this young 20-year-old's beginnings. And if you think about it, well, he's been kicking ass in the ring before he even graduated high school. He's good. What's going on, guys? It's your boy Michael Crichton, documenting the life and career of Tenshin Nasukawa prior to fame. Here for you, of course, and before they're famous. Then we decided recently that we were going to cover more athletes on this channel, and with news of this fight dropping this week. Well, who better to talk about than this young fighter? We've also done profiles on Habib Nurmagomedov. Don't try me. Anyway, we've also done his rich life video. There's a whole playlist dedicated to athletes. Be sure to check that out. For now, let's jump into Tenshin Nasukawa. Oh, these names, guys. Come on! Hey, be sure to subscribe and hit that bell. Boom! Tenshin Nezukawa was born on August 18th, 1998 in Chiba Prefecture, Japan. Now we looked up where exactly this was and it turns out it's in the greater Tokyo area. Now Tenshin showed interest in martial arts from an early age. When he was just five, his family enrolled him in karate classes. Now according to his father, the goal was to teach Tenshin about honor, respect, discipline, and concentration. His younger sister, Riri, well she's also a skilled martial artist. Now we think we found a video of he and Riri practicing with Riri inflicting some serious pain. Let's take a look. She could probably take both him and Mayweather. Now, while a career in martial arts is admirable, it's an unusual one for a man who admits to being easily frightened. In a Q&A, Tension revealed that he finds ghosts to be terrifying. He also opened up about his belief in extraterrestrial life. He stated, There is definitely life outside of Earth for sure. I believe they were here before us. During his childhood, Tension traveled from his native Japan down to Thailand and became acquainted with Muay Thai. Now returning to Japan, he was still in elementary school where he decided to spice things up and get into kickboxing. I practiced karate until I was in the sixth grade. I was winning competitions at a national level, but at the same time, there were the big shows like K1 and Pride. I wanted to participate on that big stage. There was no specific individual that inspired me. I was attracted to the stage. In 2012, 13 year old Tension began competing in kickboxing. While he was destined for greatness, Tension has admitted that he was a nervous wreck before entering his first fights, describing his training as being full of inaccurate hits and bad timing. But when he finally got into the ring, he was relaxed and ready to kick some serious 
Yikes. He soon proved not only to Japan, but to himself that he was indeed a fast and accurate force of fighting, facing some of the sport's toughest athletes. Tenshin climbed the kickboxing ladder to becoming a monster in the ring. One of his most notable matches in his early career was against the champion at the time, who was just one year older than him. <laughs> By the time he was 15, Tenshin began fighting professionally. He had finished his amateur career with 105 wins, 5 losses and 1 draw. The young man was carving out quite the story for himself. He was not even in his graduating year and already killing it in the probes. As a result of his hectic fighting schedule, well, Tenshin wasn't able to focus his heart on his studies. In order to finish school, he actually had to do an extra year. As of right now, well, he does not have any plans to go to college. He stated, I'm super happy I don't have to go to school. It's a big relief. I thought about going to college before graduating high school, but when you think about it, you can go to college anytime. Right now, it's not the time to be studying. I'm 100% focused on training right now. By the time Tenshi was 19, he had won all 25 of his pro fights, facing not just his own countrymen, but opponents from Ireland, Portugal, Greece, Brazil, China, and South Korea. Signing with the Ryzen MMA organization, he made a name for himself after his fights in 2016 and 2017, when he knocked out both opponents. In the first, it was in the first round with a spinning back kick, and in the second, it was in the fourth round with a left body hook. Tenjin has become known for having one of the meanest kicks the sport has ever seen, as well as a terrifying left hook. Watch out Mayweather. Oh my goodness, what a beautiful kick That's landed right there. Over 20 Tenjin's pro wins have been by knockout. He's also won all four of his MMA fights. In 2018, Tenjin Nasakawa, he fought four times, with his September 30th earning him the Rise Featherweight World Championship title. With a current score of 27 to nil, it made him a perfect candidate for a crazy publicized event that will no doubt make him a well known name around the world. It's also, you know, bringing the East and West together or against each other. I don't know. It's going to be a good way to spend New Year's. That's for sure. He looked like he's in great shape. Uh, uh, his, his physique looked like he, he likes to work out. On November, the world of boxing was flipped on its head when it was announced that the former world champion Floyd Money Mayweather will be coming out of retirement again, and this time to fight a kickboxer. It's like street fighters come to life. 41 year old Floyd stated that he wanted to shake things up by taking the same energy he brought to his fight in the US and bring it halfway across the world to Tokyo where the two will be squaring off this New Year's Eve. As usual, the internet gave its two cents with many in the MMA world sharing their thoughts. Comedian and former MMA pro Brendan Schaub, he summed up many people's feelings when he tweeted, I hope everyone realizes this fight will be about as legit as Macho Man versus the Ultimate Warrior in a WWE we match. Hashtag scripted. Even Conor McGregor chimed in with a jab at both fighters, comparing the match to something out of Rush Hour 5. Showing complete confidence in his abilities, Tenshin fired back at Conor with a tweet that stated, Hello Mr. McGregor, my name is Tenshin Nasikawa. I am not Jackie Chan. I promise to avenge your loss. So please watch my fight. Ah, this is gonna be great. As for the rest of the story, well, you know the story because this is before they're famous. My name's Mike McCrad and we're just two months away from this big fight. So uh, maybe we'll do an update. We did do a versus on the two fighters. You should check that out. If you're new to this channel, be sure to hit subscribe. Let us know who's next in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys in another video. Boom!